Welcome back for my final daily report market analysis video with me, Richard Perry, market analyst at Handtech on Wednesday, the 7th of October. Let's look at this gold chart, which has had some significant um, moves, actually, I think, in the last few days. We had this rally that uh, was engaging for around about seven, eight sessions, um, the rally off 1848. Um, now, the question mark has, already, has, has always been whether this was a rally into resistance, resistance being 1902 to 1926, all these old lows through August, September, housing all these old stale bulls. Would that be a move that just then tempts those old stale bulls to sell and to close their positions and, and the market to be pushed lower? You've got the momentum indicators which have been negatively or correctively configured and that still happens. And now with this bearish engulfing candle, this big decline that we saw from 1920 yesterday the market has fallen back and i think that this now puts puts pressure on um the downtrend uh, sorry the pressure on the uptrend um and the, the the fact that we've now formed what is essentially a now a two-month downtrend i think is really important because that two-month downtrend now sits around that resistance band 1902 to 1926 at the moment obviously that's going to be falling throughout this week but it suggests that, it, that that is a big ceiling a key technical ceiling for the recovery so the recovery would really have to go some to re to break back out again and uh, i think it could be a bit of a struggle on a near-term basis we've seen a bit of a kickback early doors today a bit of a rebound but that faltered at 1898 has fallen over and has lost about 10 bucks since that re, um, rebound high. But essentially, if you look at the hourly chart, it's just unwinding back into sort of selling territory around 50 on RSI. MACD lines and stochastics beginning to lose their way as well. So is this a point at which we think, well, this is going to now fall over and st start to test that uptrend, which comes in at 1867. And then if that uptrend gets broken, 1848 would be your inf inferred target. So, yeah, some really interesting moves on gold at the moment. And it looks as though that that rally has um, sort of lost its way, fallen over, and it needs to now break back above 1920, which was yesterday's high and also corresponding to an old high as well, and an old pivot line, really, 1920. Um, needs to break back above that to really suggest that um, the bulls are starting to regain some sort of control. And it doesn't look as though that is the case at the moment, but we'll see how the US responds this afternoon. So with that in mind, I wish you good luck in your trading today. Click here to subscribe to our analysis videos. Go to our website, sign up for our webinars and click to watch Trader Talks, our videos that give you ideas.